I just wanted to show you quickly what I do with my wax and how I prepare it for future use. Yes, I know that one and one or two Ain't no problem that I can't see through As long as it's just me and you My crazy little bees So I have all my wax cappings which I'll show you and anything that I've scraped off my hives throughout the um, season so any burr comb and I don't know if you've seen me squish it up and I put it in a mason jar so I'll show you that I add it to a pot with water in the bottom so here is my pot of cappings there's a bee I've added some water so that down there is water so I've got some honeycomb it's all dirty Adding that, just going to put it on minimum so I don't burn it. There's my mason jar with all my wax balls from the season and I'm going to throw that in too. Here we go. And I literally just let that sit there. And it'll probably take a good hour to melt down and then I have some cheesecloth and I pour it through the cheesecloth into a different container and let it harden and it's normally good to go after that. It's been about 20 minutes and it's slowly melting down there. Next, I have just old takeout containers. They're plastic. And I put double layer cheesecloth. And I just have three ready to go. And then I'm going to pour this melted slurry in here. Pull the cheesecloth up. All the debris I don't want will be in the cheesecloth. Throw it out. Um, and then once it hardens it should be good to go and it'll look something like that beautiful been about an hour already it's looking pretty mushy but there's some really big lumps in there so i'm gonna turn it up just a titch just to the two and most of the underbelly is 